Hey Extremers, welcome to our X-Plan video on our latest series, What Did Jesus Say? Also known as WDJS. This week's video is about what Jesus said about salt and light. So before we can discuss what Jesus said, let's first discuss who he is. Jesus is God's son. And he is also both man and God, meaning he has a body just like ours, but he was also God. And he has some amazing powers that he used to perform miracles. Now, remember the miracle where he took five loaves of bread and he had something else. I think five loaves of bread and I think he had, oh, I remember he had a shark. Five loaves of bread and a shark. Wait, no, 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 no. That's got to be wrong. Oh, yeah, five loaves of bread and it was two fish. And with that, he was able to feed 5,000 people. That's just one of his many miracles. So for today's lesson, it takes place with Jesus preaching on a mountain, which became known as a sermon on the mount. This is where Jesus discussed eight blessings called the Beatitudes. This is in Matthew chapter 5, verses 1 through 12. Now, in Matthew chapter 5, verses 13 through 16, Jesus began describing how Christians can change the world by being like salt and light. Now, I know this sounds a little confusing as how... Being like salt and light can change the world, but let's look deeper. Think of things salt is used for. Food is one of those things, right? Salt adds flavor to food. It makes something that may taste very bland taste better. Also, did you know that salt can heal certain things when we are sick? Like gargling salt water for a sore throat or a salt water solution in our noses when they're stuffy can help make us feel way better. So salt just pretty much makes things better. So what do you think, extremers? Where's a great place that you can be salty? Or, uh, <laughs> I mean, more like salt, right? So where's a place you can make impact and make things better? How about a school? And what are some things you can do? What about just helping somebody? It may be somebody who needs help with you, uh, helping them carry their books, or you may see somebody who's having a bad day, or, you know, what about with bullying? Maybe stopping somebody from bullying somebody. All those things make an impact and make somebody's day better, which when you do that, you are being like salt. So at school isn't the only place that we should be like salt. I mean, we should be like salt at our homes, at the mall, at the circus, and I mean, and even at the most boring place on earth, the grocery store. <laughs> These are all places where we can make things better. We can do things like hold the door for somebody while they're coming in or going out of the store. We can think about if somebody drops some money. We can, instead of putting it in our pocket, if we see who dropped it, we can give it to them. This is all showing people the way to be better and make the world a better place, just like Jesus wanted us to. So now, what about light? Jesus also mentioned light, which makes me think of a flashlight, or a, what about a lighthouse? Flashlights, just like a lighthouse, help us to see in the dark and allow people to get where they need to go safely. A lighthouse also helps ships stay away from dangerous areas in the water that may cause a boat to crash and sink. So Jesus wants us to be like that for the world by being salt and light, making things better and helping show people the way away from danger and other issues. There are so many different people in the world that we can impact and help. We should always look for great opportunities to make an impact and help people. Talk with your parents and guardian about ways that you can help and impact the people around you. All right, extremers, all that's left now is our memory verse. John chapter 8 verse 31 says, You are truly my disciples if you remain faithful to my teachings. So this is our memory verse for this month, Extremers, and our challenge to apply what we just learned. So don't you forget to go out and impact, make better, and help show the way to someone by being both salt and light. Until next time, Extremers, take care.